Welcome to Pro Tools Expert, my name's Dan Cooper. In this video, I'm gonna show you how you can add some interest and some intensity to your drum submixes using this Waves Smack Attack plugin. Now, for those of you that don't know, this is a very powerful transient shaper plugin. Very simple to use as well. I'll give you a very quick fly through the GUI and then we'll get onto the example. So, attack control, sustain. Play around with the attack, you're gonna get your transients popping out your speakers. Push it to the left, you're gonna be washing them out. Sustain, you're gonna be bringing up more of the tone and sustain of your audio. Sensitivity in the middle here, they're basically threshold controls. In green for attack, you can see the display at the top there, and sustain at the bottom, let's keep them set to default. And below, for each of these, we've got kind of intensity settings for each. Parallel mix control, output, all very simple. Now the example that I've got here features some drums that are very short in sustain, very transient heavy. And whilst it sounds quite punchy, the overall drums don't sound very interesting. And I'm gonna use this smack attack to kind of retain the transient nature of these drums, but add some vibe and interest and density, all that rhythmical interest to these drums. Let's have a listen to what we've got to play with. I'm sure you'll agree that's all smack and nothing else. So let's use this to bring out the sustain of those drum hits. Which it does quite well, but it's just not interesting enough. Now let's wash out the transient. Now it just sounds a little bit too touched and too safe. Let's push this quite hard and really wash out that transient. Now it's starting to sound all but over compressed, but it sounds a bit more rhythmical as well, which is nice. Play around with the threshold on the sustain. That's quite nice. Play around with the intensity on the attack. and the mix blend control down here to put back some of the original unprocessed. Push the sustain. That's nice. Play around with the duration on the sustain. You can almost hear the notes of that snare lifting after the hit, which is quite nice. Play around with the mix blend control a bit more. Drums just fall back into the mix without this. Anyway, nice little trick to that. If you haven't yet tried Smack Attack, do check out the Waves website and get yourself the demo. Hope you guys got something from this. I'm Dan from Pro Tools Expert, and I'll see you again soon.